Hello, ladies and gentlemen, 52 Super Luigi here. And I wanted to talk about the Switch and how me and it have been through, you know, it's been what? Shut up! Sorry about that. I had to take care of something. Let's just say I have Chinese t Chinese dinner. Mm -hmm. Chinese chicken go meow have four eggs. I mean, um, anyway. So as I was saying, this video is just an update video per se, but to also talk about me and the Switch. So it's been over five months since the Switch launched, and um. I'm just here to talk about the games and what I've gotten over the years. So, first of all, for you guys that have a Switch and don't have this, or for you guys that don't have a Switch yet, and when you do get a Switch, this is recommended. It's a travel case. I got the Legend of Zelda one because, you know, they didn't have a Luigi one, and I don't want a Mario one. I put my initials on it. Uh. Excuse me, but yeah. So, and what it, it comes with, so this is what it looks like, alright, my switch is inside as you can see. This, you can put whatever fits in here, and then you got this that keeps the screen protected. Then there's the switch, and then behind it, are these, and they fell out. Crap, but... These you can hold your games in, which, as you can see, I have my games in there. If you look closely, I got Arms, Fate, and Splatoon 2. And then in here, I turn it around, can't focus. I got my cart, Bomberman, Zelda, and Street Fighters. So yeah, those are my physical games. I have 14 games total, 7 download and 7 physical. <coughs> so, another recommend. So, I've had this for over 5 months since it launched. This is from the first batch. The one that was supposed to have so much problems. But as you can see, it still works pretty damn fine. I got no cracks, nothing. Sorry for the glare. Right now. Not using the best of my cameras. But you know, as you see. Works pretty damn fine. So now we get to the some of the accessories I've bought in. I have six Joy-Cons. So for some games like Mario Kart where you can play sideways, that's six players. And then for games like ARMS where there's only four player, I have three Joy-Con grips. Plus the one Pro Controller I bought. So that's four controllers that you can do this with. So, yeah, recommended if you're going to have friends over. Also, another thing recommended. Because the Joy Cons can die, <clears throat> there are two chargers. There are this. This is a choy. This is a charging Joy Con grip. As you look closely, it has a plug. It's like it's the same plug that the Pro Controller uses. You plug it in, and it keeps them going. Now. A Pro Controller is definitely recommended. 70 bucks is a lot, which is why I only bought one and then bought Joy-Cons. But then again, now Joy-Cons are the same price. And and cuz Joy-Cons are 70, 80 bucks just like a Pro Controller for the two of them. And then you got to pay another 30 for this. So actually the Pro Controller is a lot cheaper. Because cuz because with the Pro Controller you're paying 70 bucks max. With this, you're paying almost $90. So you save a couple more. Believe it or not, the Pro Controller is a lot cheaper and a lot better. So, <coughs> can't bitch. 
Now, this right here, I like very much. It is a third party thing, as you can tell. It is a Joy-Con charger. You can charge up to four on it, and it plugs in the wall, and it uses phone chargers. So, that's pretty good. And, you know, I have six Joy-Cons, so why the one grip charges being used the other four can charge on here so it's definitely recommended and it's cheap as hell it's only 20 bucks the charger this thing now the charger controller is 40 bucks so you're better off just getting this so but you know I'm getting crazy <coughs> save me but anyway now we get on to the game or should I save that for another video? I think I'll save that for another video. This is just talking about how, um, how, how my Switch has been doing and what I've bought with it over the past couple of months. It's been six months, guys. We're in the sixth month of since it's been launched. March is when it came out. It's been over five months. And I gotta say, man, this this is good quality. Um, the switch I have no scratches. Um, I was lucky enough to not get scratches on my screen, and then I got a, a screen protector on it before I ever did get scratches. So I take good care of my shit, is what I'm saying. Um, now like I said before, there you won't really see it on this camera. Because I'm using my fucking computer camera, not my tablet or phone camera, which are better. But, um, you might be able to. But, as you can see, maybe, there's little nicks on the back. And I've said this in a video before. Um, people that are getting scratches on their screen... Was it possible you were putting it in backwards? Just saying. Because the back's getting nicked up a little bit. But, you know, so. But now I got a screen protector, so now I'll never know. But, when I got it, it was a good four or five weeks before I got a um, screen protector, so. And I was putting it in and out of the dock like a fucking dick and a pussy. Oh, sorry. Was that, was that, um. I get flagged for that. Um, anyway, <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in the next episode where I talk about my 17 games and which ones I like and which ones I fucking wish I didn't get. So see you later.